I'm here with Natalie Denier at IBM to dive into how businesses are really using AI and what's actually working. Natalie, thank you so much for joining me. Thank you for having me. It's great <laughs> to be here. Natalie, I know you're working with AXA right now, who have gone from five minutes and policy responses all the way down to five seconds. Yeah. When you think about that, not just from that lens, but also from, yeah. a, from an automation lens too, they're able to uh, refund customers without even having to pick up the phone. This is absolutely brilliant. Yeah. Tell me about that. I think we're all becoming quite familiar now is that actually it's about 20% yeah. of the of the overall uh, transformation. What we really need to be thinking about is how we infusing the AI mindset mm -hmm. across the organization as we go through that transformation. And that really starts at the top with leadership. Mm -hmm. We need to be thinking about the business strategy yeah. and the AI strategy and how we infuse the two together. I know some, some IBM research highlighted that 66% of UK businesses are seeing real productivity gains with AI, but only 1% of enterprise data is actually being used in these AI models. Yep. How do we think about closing that gap between these sort of early wins versus real tangible transformation? I think the remarkable statistic that only 1% of enterprise data is being used in AI models today is kind of quite shocking actually really. An amazing opportunity, untapped on, on opportunity there. But we have to really be asking ourselves, why is that? What, what is the inhibitor there? And it will come down to the fact that data is siloed, 90 plus percent of it is unstructured. Mm. So how do you create that data foundational level upon which you can build upon as you're implementing those AI solutions? I know IBM yourself, you know, creating three and a half billion dollars worth of yes. uh, productivity gains yes. by using your own AI internally first. When we think about that and actually extending that, you know, how can other organizations follow suit? But then also from an IBM lens, how yeah. was that coming to be so wonderfully fruitful? An uh, example would be our Ask HR uh, digital assistant which has been phenomenally successful. 2024, we had about 11.5 million transactions from managers and employees leveraging the Ask HR digital assistant, which is effectively a manager asking anything from how do you move an employee, promote an employee, do, do all the basic day-to-day -day activities. About 94% of them did not require human interaction. In addition, the managers and employees themselves, those requests and those uh, interactions with the tooling 75% faster than if they were working with a human.